Ralphie, we're here after today's victory over Lincoln. Give us your thoughts on that 3-1 victory. Um, I think it was a really good performance. You know, you look at um, the game as an obviously an individual game. I think it's finished three-one. It could have been comfortable, really, the amount of chances that we've created and the amount of chances that we've sort of squandered. Um, and then what happens is you go down the other end and they equalise and, and you get sort of asked questions. And we've answered those questions. We've gone up the other and scored two two goals at the other end and obviously made it three-one. And, and you look at Mikey's performance. He's absolutely lit the place up on it all afternoon. He's running at people and. Just said to him at the end, you know, that's that's the Mikey done that we want week in week out. The last four or five weeks, what we've seen is is when he's in this frame of mind and when he's when he's enjoying his football and he's got a smile on his face. Ultimately, that's what you get. And he's been unplayable today, as have a lot of people. And you know, I think there's a lot of performances out there that were eight, nine out of ten, um, and that's been the, that's been the case in the last two or three weeks. We went up to Evan, put a good performance. I went to Sheffield, put a good performance on, and unfortunately made made individual errors and if you do that at this level you get punished for them and, and obviously that's what the, that's what happened on that day so you know we asked for a response we asked we asked to, to make less errors and we've done that as a group and, and ultimately it's ended in three points you touched on it there there's been some some good performances despite despite the results but today when they called it back to one apiece were you worried that it was going to happen again or were you, were you confident the boys had it in hand? you're always worried you know when you're wasting them chances you're always worried and culminating the, the fact that we're missing chances you, you're expecting a sucker punch and you put that alongside the, the recent form and the recent mistakes that we've made that have cost us three points instead of you know we've gone away with one instead of three and we've gone away with none instead of one and, and you start to worry but ultimately we've answered them questions as I was saying it's been disappointing we're starting to look over his shoulder a little bit which should never be in the case this season we were in a good position and we sort of tossed that away in the last month and, and that's disappointing but we had to make sure that we didn't get drawn into anything down the bottom end we we're still looking up the table we still want to finish as high as possible and that performance backs that up and we've got another tough game monday now where we have to put another performance in touched on monday stocksbridge tough game into the the final few games now what's your what's your hopes for those games we want to win every game, so the, you know we, we're not letting up. We, we've got a lot of pride. I've got a lot of pride. The rest of the staff have, and the players have. So, you know, teams will let seasons sort of peter out, and teams will who just go through the motions a little bit. You know, are the ones who aren't proud. So, we want to make sure we, we give a good reflection of ourselves. Take every game as it comes. Look to win every game. Um, and if we can't have any impact on our season, we'll, we'll try and have impact on other seasons. And, uh, and whether it's helping teams out or hurting teams. We're in all four games to win them and that's what we'll look to do. Brilliant, well done today.